Nike is not the only multi-billion dollar company sparking controversy. Tonight, Levi's is catching both heat and support for a new campaign on gun control. Night Beach Joe Vasquez has reaction. San Francisco's fabled jean maker has now entered the public debate over gun control. The CEO of Levi Strauss, Chip Berg, wrote in an op-ed for Fortune magazine that it's time to take a stand. Quote, we simply can't stand by silently when it comes to the issues that threaten the very fabric of the communities where we live and work. While taking a stand can be unpopular with some, doing nothing is no longer an option. Berg went on to say Levi's will be partnering with Michael Bloomberg to form a coalition of business leaders to advocate for gun control. Craig DeLuce is with the pro-Second Amendment group Firearms Policy Coalition in Sacramento. Another multi-millionaire has decided that they want to invest their millions of dollars and their fortune into taking away the rights of everyday citizens. Sounds like business as usual. Folks we talked to outside the Levi's store on Market Street say Levi's and Nike are taking a slight gamble for taking a stand. A lot of people are standing up for us, so it's a good thing, you know what I mean? And they're being the first to jump on board, and I hope another and more companies start jumping on board. I like their stuff, number one. Number two, I support gun control. I mean, I think we have a big problem. I'm not trying to take away people's rights, but I do think there needs to be stricter rules. Nike burn, baby. While upset customers on social media are setting Nike merchandise on fire, that hasn't been the case today for Levi's. These jeans were set aflame last year after Levi's banned guns in its stores. Today, this Facebook user says he's not going to set his pants on fire, but posted a picture of his semi automatic handgun. Hashtag MyLevi's, MyGun. On the Night Beat, I'm Joe Vasquez.